Really about 15 years ago, when I first came out with the book, I, I began to see it everywhere, how trust um, made such a profound difference and impact on everything. And how most of this stuff on trust was either too soft or too academic, hmm. you know, too simplistic or, or, or too high level and, and not practical enough. And, and, um, and I felt like trust is impacting everything in leadership, in life. It is trust that makes our world go round. And yet we've kind of either approached it too simplistically, kind of trust everyone you know, or too academically with, you know, just two um, erudite models that are not practical and useful. Yep. And so I felt like this is so useful and so, so important and it's impacting everything and we've got to get our arms around it and we can, we can actually build trust on purpose. And I felt like I could make a difference in contributing to the conversation. So I felt called to focus on trust. And so that was 15 plus years ago, I guess, 16 years ago, two, uh, 2006, when the, when the Speed of Trust book came out. And the interesting thing, Dustin, is I recently put out an updated edition of the Speed of Trust book, and I, I added an afterword. And the afterword was titled, The Top 10 Reasons Why Spe the Tr Speed of Trust book is more relevant today <laughs> Than it was when I published it, you know, uh, 15 plus years ago. And, and it's because while it hit me 15 plus years ago, you look around today, just to your point, we've never seen a need for greater trust than we do right now. And that's especially true in education as we're, you know, navigating through and coming out of this pandemic and where we are in this process and, and, um, and the need for trust and for inspiration for that matter as well, is just, is just so great. And at, with all stakeholders at every level and, and um, you know, for, for teachers, for, for administrators, for principals, for superintendents, uh, there's, we, we live in a world of declining trust. And so uh, it's become so important because of the lack of it. It's kind of like uh, what Warren Buffett said about air um, you know, and, and trust. He said, trust is like the air that we breathe. And when it's present, you don't focus on it as much, but when it's absent, then everyone notices. And right now we're seeing an absence of trust. So everyone is noticing. Mm -hmm.